What does neurotransmitters have to do with Lyme? I'm Dr. Cameron. I'm a Lyme disease expert. Now, we always think of nerves connected to a nerve, just like the electrical system in your house. But the nerve is actually connected by a bunch of chemicals, and they are called neurotransmitters. And they're kind of nice because they allow very quick change to a flight, to a flight or a combination. And when they're off, that can regulate the whole system rather quickly. That's, that's why Lyme disease patients can often have these huge waves of symptoms. They take an antibiotic, they get a Herxheim reaction, they eat some sugar, they drink some alcohol. Sometimes the barometric pressure changes, uh, stress can change it. And so the symptoms can wildly change. They can be better one hour and then bomb the next hour. They can uh, wake up like roadkill. All along that neurotransmitter is just creating that endless amount of uncontrolled symptoms and it's a driving force that drives patients and families crazy.